Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels. So if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. I hope everybody's had as good weekend as possible. And uh, thank you and welcome to um, all my new, uh, new and old subscribers. Um, again, I love you all and thank you for uh, subscribing. Um, again, if you're new here to my channel and you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Um, I'm always looking for more uh, new and uh, new subscribers. So uh, thank you for doing so. Um, also, don't forget to comment down below. Um, I love responding to um, all your comments. Um, and likes. So uh, today I'm going to be doing uh, Travel News Worldwide 10 Exciting Facts November 2022 Part 5. Um, that's I'm getting the information from um, breakingtravelnews.com so I'm going to fire away with number one which is Rolls Royce and EasyJet uh, Aviation World's at first Rolls Royce and EasyJet uh, uh, today have confirmed wow a set uh, new aviation uh, milestone with the world's uh, first run of a modern aero engine on hydrogen wow that sounds interesting and fantastic and good luck to both um easy jet and rolls royce for that um number two um world travel and tourism council's 22nd global summit in rydia rydia which is the capital of uh, south the kingdom of saudi arabia set to be the big the biggest um, over at uh, the World um, Travel and Tourism Council WTTC tw uh, 22nd Global Summit opens its door in Ryder, Saudi Arabia today in what is set to be the largest event in history. Wow, and I hope it goes as well as possible um, for the World Travel and Tourism Council and so at Saudi Arabia. Uh, number three, meet the legendary chef Mamo at the heart of Raidia, which is the capital of Saudi Arabia. The legendary chef Mamo, the founder of uh, Mamo Michelangelo, that perfectly embodies the Italian and South of France flavours it's arrived it's arriving in at Ryder, the, uh, the capital of saudi arabia in a, a special visit so good luck uh, to saudi arabia and um mamo the chef wow that sounds amazing i love italian food <laughs> um number four uh, Middle East, um, Asia Pacific to account for 80, uh, sorry, Middle East, Asia uh, Pacific to account for 58% of global air passengers, wow, by uh, 2040. It looks like uh, people in the Middle East uh, like to travel a lot then at 58% or just c uh, can afford to travel a lot. Um, uh, number five, Holiday Inn Express um, undercovers happy tactile happiness. I, I love this chain, Holiday Inn Express and uh, that's lovely I love all the bri uh, bright walls um, 
in the hotels or the holiday in chain in general and uh, number six according to um, optimism insurers inflate travel covers at cost by um, $460 for disabled people um, which again is not, uh, not good but we can't really uh, do anything uh, really number seven WTTC revealed um, ben uh, Benhamans but sorry reveal women speakers at the global summit in Radia Saudi Arabia which is uh, really good and um, it's and uh, number eight um, popularity of red tourism uh, jumps among uh, Chinese youths so that's good and uh, number nine Hyatt um, announced the opening of Hyatt Regen Regency in Traverdon so good luck to that and uh, the red tourism last but not least a global traveler survey reveals um international travel so um again i hope um england uh, to uh, today we, uh, we do beat wales uh, fingers crossed um because <laughs> it wasn't a very good performance just uh, say against the USA but hopefully we'll have a better performance tonight and I would like to say thank you for watching and uh, bye for now um, I hope to catch up uh, with it because I'm working tonight um, and just like, uh, like I did Strictly over the weekend um, and again it's a shame that Ellie um, had to go out um, but obviously the right decision was uh, made so and um, I really enjoyed the Strictly performances um, over the weekend all of them and uh, well done to all the people in the show uh, from the lighting and the judges and to the contestants and the professional dancers so thank you for watching and i'll see you tomorrow and uh, bye for now thank you bye